Today we're going to be talking about the authority of Jesus. Kyo wa shiesu no kin initsuite nashimasu. And our main passage will be Luke chapter 7 verses 1 to 17. Omo no seishu no kasho wa ruku ni yoru fukun sho nare sho isetsu kara junan setsu made. Ja, hajime masho. Let's get started. Luke chapter 7 verse 1. Ruka nare sho isetsu when Jesus had finished saying all this in the hearing of the people, he entered Capernaum. Yesu wa minshu ni korida no kotobo subete hanashi oete kara kafre naum ni hairarita. Kono saki wa mo ruka rokusho de wa shiesu wa oki no koto o oshiete irishaimashita. Jesus taught many things in chapter 6 of Luke, so now he's saying that he's finished with that and he's going on. So today shiesu wa a. So, what is this town of Capernaum? Capernaum to you machi wa doko de shoka, to you machi desu ka? Well, you can see on this map, it's at the northern edge of the Sea of Galilee, and the Sea of Galilee, of course, is in the northern part of Israel. Chizu o mitara, ano, garadayako ga arimasu ne? Garadayako wa Israel no hokubu ni aru no desu. そして、カフェナムという町はその木とのほとりにありますね。それはシエスはよく滞在していた町ですね。そして弟子のペトロの家もその町にありました。This is a town that Jesus was staying in very often and also lead disciple perhaps Peter his home was there as well. Let's go on to verse 2. He says, There a centurion's servant, whom his master valued highly, was sick and about to die. Tokuro de aru hyakunin taicho ni omonjirarete iru buku ga byoki de shini kakate ita. So we can see here that there's a centurion and he has a servant who's sick. Kokuni wa mo hyakunin taicho ga ite sono buku wa byoki ni natta sono shimobi desu ne. Well, in the Roman military, a centurion commanded a hundred men, which is easy to remember if you remember that the word century and centurion have the same root. Roma gun de wa hyakunin taicho ka hyakunin no heishi o shishiki shite imashita. Nihongo de wakari yasui desu ne, sono kanji kara sugu wakaru no desu. And if you compare it to today's military, a centurion would basically be something like a captain today in the army. Gendai no guntai to kurabete mitara yakunin taicho no kurai wa hobo rikugun no taii ni soto shite iru disho. Verse 3, Sunsets. The centurion heard of Jesus and sent some elders of the Jews to him asking him to come and heal his servant. Yesu no koto o kita hyakunin taicho wa yuriya jin no choro tachi o tsukai ni yatte buku o tasuki ni kite kurusaru yoni ni tanonda. So this is interesting because it says the elders of the Jews. Now these would not be the elders of the whole Jewish people, but rather the elders of the synagogue in the town of Capernaum. Yuriya jin no choro tachi to kakarete imasu kere demo. Kore wa yuriya jin zentai no choro jinakte Sono machi no kaido no choro tachi datte de sho. And when they came to Jesus, they pleaded earnestly with him. This man deserves to have you do this because he loves our nation and has built our synagogue. Choro tachi wa yesu no moto ni kite neshi ni negatta. Ano kata wa soshite itadaku ni fusuwashi hito desu. Watashi tachi yudai jin o aishite mizu kara kaido o so this centurion seems to be actually very much a good guy. And actually there are several centurions that appear in the New Testament and the ones uh, that appear there always seem to be pretty good guys. So Jesus went with them. He was not far from the house when the centurion sent friends to say to him, 
Lord, don't trouble yourself, for I do not deserve to have you come under my roof. So could the Yesua Ishini de Kakirarita. Tokuro ga, son of Ie Karahodo, Tokada nu Tokuro Made, Kita Toki, Yakunin Tai Chova, Tomodachi of Sky Niate Iwasita. Shuyo Go Sokuro Niwa Oyobi Masen. Watashiwa Anato, Jibun no Yane no Stani, Omukai de Kiri Yona, Mono dewa Arimasen. Koko dewa Tsugu, Hano. 100人隊長は金さんの態度をとっていますね。私はそのお迎えする人ではありません。Now we see here the centurion is actually uh, being very humble. He says, you know, I don't deserve for you to come. That is why I did not even consider myself worthy to come to you. But say the word and my servant will be healed. ですから私の方から お伺いするのさい。不足はしくないと思いました。人とことおっしゃってください。そして私の死亡病を癒してください。そこの100人隊長はシエスは奇跡ができる信じていて、またシエスはそこまで行く必要はない。もうどういうところからでも、もうその死
もうローマの軍隊の役員隊長でイエスを信じています。この箇所ではもう役人隊長は直接その役人隊長と会ったことはありませんでしたね。So in this passage, the centurion did not directly meet Jesus. But in many works of art, we see that、uh, the centurion is pictured as kneeling before Jesus, as it is in this painting here. Luke は100年隊長がもう長老たちを通してシエスに願ったことが明らかですね。それはシエスと100年隊長は直接会ったことはなかったですね。今読んだ箇所で。しかし、多くの芸術作品は、もうその百年大象は、もうシエスの前に描かれていることとなっています。どうしてでしょうかその答えは、マタイ発書にあります。Well, the answer is in Matthew chapter 8. マタイ発書は、このルカナネショと同じあ物語を記録しています。In Matthew 8, we can find the same story as we found here in Luke 7. And Matthew 8 5 says, When Jesus had entered Capernaum, a centurion came to him asking for help. Matai Hashio Gosets de Wa, Sati Yesuga Kafernam ni Hairari Rito, Hitori no Hyakunin Taicho ga, Chikazui te Kite, Kongan Shi, to Arimas ne. So, Kono Oku no Gejitsu Saku Hin wa, Matai ni Motozui te Imas ne, Luka Jinakte. So these works of art are based on what you find in Matthew chapter 8, not on what was in Luke 7. But there's a difference then between Matthew's gospel and Luke's gospel in this story. しかし、それで、この箇所、この物語に対して、マタイによる福音書とルクによる福音書の間に違いがありますね。In Matthew 8, the centurion went to Jesus himself, but in Luke 7, he sends others to meet Jesus. マタイ発祥では100人隊長が自らイエスのとこへ行きました。しかし、ルカ7章では彼が他の人をイエスのとこに行かせたのです。So we have to ask, is this a conflict between these gospels? Is it a contradiction? それで聞かなくてはいけないことがあるでしょう。これは、これらの福音書の間に矛盾があるのですかどうでしょうか Well, Thinking about this, I think not really, because Matthew is writing for the Jews, but Luke is writing for the Romans, and they each include the details that are important for the culture they are targeting. 実はそうではないと思います。マタイはユリア人向きに書いていますが、ルクはローマ人向きです。それぞれ対象とする文化にとって重要な詳細を盛り込んでいるのです。So we have to think about this, you know, as we're reading and say, the Gospels are true history, but they are also literary art. And they're designed to bring faith to particular groups of people. So our modern cultures are very strict about exact details, but ancient cultures were different. So I think we have to say, allow some artistic license sometimes in these minor differences that have no real meaning. Fukuin Shou wa. マコトの歴史でありながら同時に文学芸術でもありますね。それを覚えておいた方がいいですね。それでために福音書の間でもいろいろの別に無意味の違いですでもいろいろ違いが出ている詳細に。でも実は現代文化は詳細に非常に厳格です。しかし古代の文化は違いました。そのような詳細に対してのもう厳格はありませんでした。もっと自由な考え方でした。それである程度の、まあ、私的あ教養を認めましょう。Now, in the story we just looked at, we saw that Jesus has authority over sickness. 今読んだ箇所では、もうイエスは病気に対する権威を持っていることが示されました。But as we look at the whole of the、uh, Gospels, we see that Jesus also demonstrated his authority over nature and demons and even death. でも、福音書全体的を見たら、もう、イエスは、自然や悪魔、そして死に対する気にさえも示されたことがあります
Tatoeba. For example, we go to Mark chapter 4, verse 39. We have this verse that's in the middle of the story about how Jesus and the disciples, they got in a boat and they're going across the Sea of Galilee when there's a big storm. So, what does this say? He got up, he rebuked the wind, and said to the waves, Quiet, be still. Then the wind died down, it was completely calm. So, today, Shiesu wa Oki agate, Kaze o shikari, Mizumi ni damari, Shizumari to, Iwarita, Suruto, Kaze wa yami, Sukari, Nagi ni natta. これはシエスはもう大自然に対して気にも持っているシャルと示されているところです。So here we see this is an example of how Jesus has authority over nature and the powers of nature as well. And then if we go over to Matthew chapter 8, we can also find one of the stories of Jesus casting out demons. マタイ8章に行ってみたらもうシエスはもう悪霊を追い出す物語の一つが書かれています。And we see Matthew 8:31 and 32. The demons begged Jesus, if you drive us out, send us into the herd of pigs. He said to them, Go. So they came out and went into the pigs. そこで悪霊どもはイエスに我々を追い出すのなら、あの豚の中にやってくると願った。イエスが行け。と言われると、悪霊どもは二人から出て、ブツの中に入った。それ、悪霊も、シエスの命令に従わなくてはいけないのです。So the demons also had to obey Jesus' command. And we see that's also true of the head of demon Satan. そして、悪霊の蝶、あの、サタン、悪魔もそうです。In Matthew chapter 4, you have the story of how Jesus was tempted by the devil. But how does that end? So, do what? Dono yo ni owarimas. Matthew 4, 10 and 11. Matai yoncho ju sets to ju i sets. Jesus said to him, Away from me, Satan! For it is written, Worship the Lord your God and serve him only. And then the devil left him. Suto Yesu wa iwarita, Shidezuke Satan. Anata no kami de aru shu o ogami tara shu ni tsukai yo to kaite aru. Soko de akuma wa hanari satta to arimas. So Jesus has authority over sickness, he has authority over nature and even over demons and the devil himself. So de Shiesu wa mo. あの病気に対して、自然に対して、悪霊どもと、あの悪魔にも、それに対して、金利を持っていらっしゃいます。まあ、ルクによる福音書7章に戻りましょう。11節から。So let's get back to Luke chapter 7 and we'll start it at verse 11. Now, if you look at the map, you can see that south of Nazareth, where the red dot is, is going to be the town of Nine. この地図をご覧になれば、ナズレの南の方にナインという町がありますね。この聖句はそれについてかかっています。これもイスラエルの北部にあります。ガイザイエコと近いです。This is also the northern part of Israel, close to the Sea of Galilee. Now, soon afterward, Jesus went to a town called Nain, and his disciples and a large crowd went along with him. So, でから間もなくイエスはナインという町に So, if you go to Nine today, it looks something like this photo here. You know, and you can see it's a small town, it's actually a population of about 2,000. And in Jesus' time, it was probably even much smaller. But there is a church there, Sokuniwa Kyokai ga arimas, 
And that is a church which commemorates the passage, the story that we are reading now. その教会は記念教会でもう今読んでいる箇所の記念の教会です。So it says, The Church of the Resurrection of the Widow's Son in Name. 内にあるやもめの生き返らせた息子の教会とあります。Verse 12, 12 says, As he approached the town gate, a dead person was being carried out, the only son of his mother, and she was a widow. And a large crowd from the town was with her. Yes, got much in the money, Chikazu Kareruto, Chodo, Aruha Oyeno Hitori Musco got Shinde, Kanga Katsugida Sariru Tokro Data, Sonha Oyawa, Yamome de Ate, Machino Hitoga, Oze, Sobuni, Ikisote, Ita. Haha Oye desne, Mo Yamome des. そして一人息子が死んでしまったところになります。なんと寂しいことでしょう。そしてその当時の社会の中でそのヤモメはもう必ず貧乏になってもう新しい人との出会いがない限りあの生活は辛いでしょう。大変でしょう。So we see that Woman, the mother, is actually already a widow, and now her only son has died. And unless she meets somebody else, you know, and starts a new life,、uh, in that society, in that time, she's almost certainly going to end up very poor and have a very desperate and difficult life. What about Jesus? She is one of the show. When the Lord saw her, his heart went out to her, and he said, Don't cry. She wa kono haha o yo mite aware ni omoi. もうなかなかとも良いと言われた。ここでシエスの道場、シエスの慈悲が示されていますね。So here we see Jesus'、uh, compassion and his mercy. He says, don't cry. もうなかなかとも良いと言われました。Then he went up and touched the coffin, and those carrying it stood still. He said, young man, I say to you, get up. そして近づいて、かに手を触れると、担いでいる人たちは立ち止まった。イエスは、若者よ、あなたに言う。起きなさい、と言われた。どうなったでしょうか ?What happens next? 何でしょう、十五節。Chapter 7, verse 15. The dead man sat up and began to talk, and Jesus gave him back to his mother. How happy his mother must have been. How amazed must the whole town have been by this great miracle. すると、死人は起き上がって、物を言い始めた。イエスは息子をその母親にお返しになった。あの、お母さんはもうすごく嬉しかったでしょう。町全体はこの驚くべきの奇跡にもうすごく感謝していたでしょう。すごいことですね。信念を生き返らせたのですね。イエスの力で。It's a very amazing story. This dead man is raised by the power of Jesus. They were all filled with awe and praised God. A great prophet has appeared among us, they said. God has come to help his people. 人々は皆恐れを抱き、神を賛美して、大予言者が我々の間に現れたといい。また、神はその民を国にかけてくださったと言った。この人たちは、シエスは大予言者であると思ったのですね。それはもう素晴らしいです。でも、実はシエスは予言者よりもっと偉大な方ですね。神様ご自身はその町に来たのです。Now they say he's a great prophet and Uh, they're amazed by this, but they're actually not realizing that Jesus is actually much more than a great prophet. He is God Himself come to their village. This news about Jesus spread throughout Judea and the surrounding country. Yes, ni tsuite kono hanashi wa Yudea no zendo to mowari no chiho itai ni hiromata. So de mino wa wai wai shite imas ne. Yes, no koto o hana shite imas. もうこの素晴らしい奇跡ができる方、私たちの間に現れました。So everybody celebrating and they're 
noisy and, you know, giving thanks, you know, for this great person that has been given to them who can do these miracles. Now, here Jesus demonstrates his power over death. ここでは、イエスはあのもう死に対しての力を示されました。But he also did this several other times in the Gospels. もう他の聖書の箇所、福音書の箇所で、イエスは他の人を家帰らせたこともあります。もっとも有名なのは、ラズロの話でしょう。The most famous is probably the story of Lazarus. You know, there's Lazarus and Martha. And Mary were、uh, three siblings. このラズロとマルタとマリアはもう兄弟姉妹でしたね。And they were friends of Jesus. She is no Eugene でした。So when Lazarus got sick, they sent a message、uh, to Jesus. そしてラズロは病気になった時、その姉妹はシエスにもうメッセージを伝えました、知らせました。So, Jesus came, but he did not come immediately. シエスは来てくださいましても、今すぐ来てくださってじゃなくて、ちょっと後でした。ヨハネ11章17節を見ましょう。Let's look at John 11, 17. On his arrival, Jesus found that Lazarus had already been in the tomb for four days. さて、イエスが行ってご覧になると、ラズドは墓に葬られてすでに、4日も経っていた。でも、人は希望はないですね。この人はもう死んで褒められたことです。4日前に。So there's no hope for here the, among the people for Lazarus. You know, he's, he's been dead for four days already. Now, when Jesus arrived, he was soon talking to Martha. ラズドはついてからすぐマルタと話していました。And Martha answered and says, I know he will rise again in the resurrection the last day after Jesus tried to encourage her. She is a Martha, or Hagemeste Ite, Martha, or Wari no Hino Fukatsu no Tokini, Fukatsu Suru Kotowa, Zonjite, or Imas to Ita. But Jesus had something much greater to tell her. She is a Moto Oki no Koto, Stai Mashita. Jesus said to her, I am. The resurrection and the life. He who believes in me will live even though he dies. Yes, why, Warita. Watashi wa fukatsu de ari, inochi de aru. Watashi wa shinjiru mono wa shinde mo ikiru. Nanto suburashi koto des. What a wonderful thing. Jesus is the resurrection. Shiesu go zishin wa fukatsu des. Inochi des. Jesus is the resurrection and the life. Let's、uh, skip a little bit and we'll go to verses 43 and 44 in John 11. ちょっと飛びますが、ヨハネ11章43、44節見ましょう。They have opened the grave of Lazarus. もう、ラズのお墓は、もう、あ、開けたところですね。When he said this, Jesus called in a loud voice, Lazarus, come out, and the dead man came out. His hands and feet wrapped with strips of linen and a cloth around his face. And Jesus said to them, Take off the grave clothes and let him go. こう言ってから、ラズロ出てきなさいと大声で叫ばれた。すると死んでいた人が手と足を布で巻かれたまま出てきた。かは、おいで包まれていたイエスは人々に、届いてやって生かしなさいと言われた。シエスはラズロお墓から出てきなさいと命じられた時にラズロは出てきました。4日前に死んだ人でしてでもシエスは新しい命を与えてくださいました。So Jesus says, Lazarus come out and the dead man came out even though he had been dead for four days. Jesus is Life itself, and he gave this dead man new life. In what we've seen here, Jesus demonstrates his authority over sickness, nature, and demons, and death. Well, in my mother, Yonda, Kasha Deva, Yeswa, Byoki, Ya, Shizin, Ya, Akuma, Soste, Shini, Tai, Suru, Kindi, Mo, Shimisari, Mashta. Jesus is well able to meet our every need. 
、イエスは私たちのありゆる必要を満たすことが出来になります。Let's trust in Jesus. イエスを信頼しましょう。信じましょう。Let's believe in Him. Now, how much authority does Jesus have? イエスはどのぐらい権威を持っていらっしゃるでしょうか Well, in Matthew chapter 28, verse 18, Jesus told us, マタイによる福音書28章18節にシエスはその答えをくださいました。Then Jesus came to them and said, All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. イエスは地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球上で聞いて言われた。私は地球サミーテイの神様で、父なる神、ミコなる神、シエス、トセイデイサバ。So, the Father gave Jesus this power in the Trinity of God, the Father, God the Son, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit. And Jesus gave us a command also, シエスは、私たちにも、使命してくださいました。He gave us a mission. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit in this translation, and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you. And surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. だから、あなた方は言って、すべてのためを私の弟子にしなさい。かえに父とこと聖霊の名によって、洗礼を授け、あなた方に命じておいたことをすべて守るようにおしなさい。私は世の終わりまでいつもあなた方と共にいる。Now this last sentence here, this last word is so important to us. And surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. What a wonderful promise. It's a promise that Jesus is with us always and even now he is here with us. Even though we cannot see him, but he lives in our hearts and he ministers among us. なんと素晴らしい約束。私たちはもう一人ぼっちになってしまうことは絶対ありません。And so we will never be alone. We will never have to be without others to support us because Jesus is always with us. Let's pray. お祈りします。イエス・キリストの父なる神様。あなたは多くの恵みを与えてくださって、私たちのためにシエスを与えてくださいました。シエスは私たちのために、十字架行きの道を歩まれてくださいました。十字架上で死んでくださったことも、私たちの罪の許し、私たちの救いのために。そして、あなたはシエスにすべての権能を与えてくださったと書かれています。聖書にはそれも感謝です。で私たちは終わりの日に私たちのことをよく分かっていらっしゃるシエスに出会い、シエスと共に家を過ごすことができます。天国で。私たちはあなたは権利があることを止めていますどうか私たちを導いてください。毎日毎日、御言葉に従うことができるように助けてください。精霊の導きによって、あなたの力によって、私たちは問題と辛いこといっぱいあっても、それを乗り越えることができるのです。あなたの恵みによって、感謝します。今聞いている人々にも、この後、このビデオを見る人にも、あなたの恵みを与えてください。愛を注いでください
私たち一人一人あなたと出会いができますようにあなたと共に歩むことができるように助けて導きくださいまたご家族ご親戚隣人にもこの町のすべての人々にもあなたの恵みを与えください多くの感謝を持って、シエスの皆によってお祈りいたします。アーメン。